Welcome back guys to Biscuits Total War. This is Biscuits giving you the joint campaign of myself and Legend of Total War. Now it's been a couple of weeks since we actually last had a few of these episodes going up and the reason being Legend of Total War unfortunately had a virus on his PC which basically stumped this campaign for a few weeks. But anyway, looking back on the last episode which was on Legend of Total War's episode uh, channel even, He's done a bit of work, he hasn't done a huge amount, he's taken out the Britons, but what we need to try and do is really crank it up and try and get the momentum going back on this campaign, because we're now on episode number 27, ideally I want to try and finish this by early 30s at the end of the day, so I want to try and take out Egypt, I want to try and take out the Midians, really try and crunch these factions down to the ground, so Legend of Total War can focus on the Spanish, that is the plan, so... Legend of Total War has got this army which is slowly sneaking around here. I'm going to use these guys to try and take out this settlement down at the bottom, like so. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to sneak the rest of these guys now to join in. We've got a decent sized stack. We're going to take out Thebes next episode. And we should have a little spy in here, I believe. I'm going to send this spy off to Memphis so they can try and sneak into that settlement. In the meantime, let's go and have a look to see what's going over here with the midi. Now, I've got quite a big stack here. What I'm going to do, I'm going to pull out a bunch of these units. Let's get all of the cav units out, in fact. And we'll get a couple of infantry units out, I think. And we'll use these guys to push back these guys here. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to fight this on the map. Try and take out this leader here, or one of the faction leaders for these Numidians. And send this army, which is down here, off towards Tingi. Come on, let's see what we can try and do. We should be able to do this nice and easy. Don't really need my infantry units. I'll put those guys to the side. It's all about my cav units. And where are they deploying? Let's go and have a look. Looks like they're deploying up on that mountain, up that hill, all the way up there. So, we'll get our cav, we'll move them forward. We're going to put triple speed on. We're going to try and make this a really good episode. We're going to try and make sure that we've killed loads of Numidians, loads and loads of Egyptians, and taken, most importantly, a bunch of settlements. Right. Let's try and take this high ground. There we go, taking the high ground. Now we're going to chuck in our javelins, do as much damage as we can. What have they got? They've just got some Numidian horsemen. Which are going to do little to nothing against my guys. Come on, right. Let's just charge everything we've got now down this hill. Take him out. Take out that general. Come on, general is dead. The enemy show their true virtue. They are not soldiers, only frightened rabbits running. Have we killed him? I think we have actually killed him. And then these units can just chase down those camels like so. Come on, they're gonna die anytime now. This is a victory fit for the gods. Okay, they killed 37 of my men. One of their men survived, but that is not too bad. We should be able to keep them pressing forward and heading towards Tingi. Basically, last or the two last settlements that we've got to take off in the millions we're going to take them out I'm going to rip these guys a new arsehole that's the plan anyway right so how many turns that one two three turns and we should be there now what i might do might send these guys over here as well so one two three three turns we should be there to midi Let's just try and get a temple here, and we'll get a shed load of peasants, I reckon. And we'll get these pike units out. Some javelin units. And we'll send these guys down to Nepti. So three turns or four turns before we get there. Split that army up a bit. So that's doing okay, and what we're going to do in here, we're going to produce some more pikes, which is good. Demidi, I just hope that's not going to riot. We're going to have a load of 
peasants being produced. That might just be enough there. And um, what can we do here? We can, re we can get some more units, which we will do. There we go. I actually might send one of these units back. Send that unit back in there. There we go. So at least that settlement's going to be a little bit happier. Next thing I'm going to do, we're going to try and send our armies, which we've got up here, send them all south. Clear victory, sunk those rebels. Should have a little army here. Let's send these guys south. Come on. Like so, that's great. Now I've got loads of generals here. Let's chuck one of those generals in that settlement. Let's chuck some more of these generals. In fact, let's just get a bunch of these guys out of here. Get rid of that unit. Don't need that. We'll merge a bunch of these units together. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of camels. There we go. Send those guys out. Now, we have got a temple, which isn't one of ours. So we're going to get rid of that temple. We'll build our own temple. And we'll get a couple of peasant units there just to make sure they're ticking okay. And we might just build a little watchtower there just to check out what's going on. So these guys are going to move south. Got some Jav Cav here, which chuck into Damascus. Get rid of those guys in there. Get rid of those guys there. Let's build a couple of peasants. Get rid of them, get rid of them, and them. Antioch's fine. Let's get that Javcav, move them south. Oh, probably build some peasants up there. Like so, just make sure that settlement's okay. It's not going to riot on me. Right, can we merge these units together? I'm sure we can. There we go. Right, we'll get this general. Chuck him there. We'll get these pike units. Chuck them in there. Now we'll get these archers. And we'll chuck them there. So what have we got? Nine pikes, four archers. Let's get some jav cav. There we... Oh, no, we can't quite get those guys in there. Get some more generals, maybe. Maybe some more pike units there in a moment. Another general unit there. Um, what have we got left? So let's chuck one of these generals in here. Um, right. What else can we chuck in there? Chuck that jab cabin there. Get some more units like so. We're just putting to give a nice little army, I think. Oh, crumbs. Chuck those pikes in there. I think that's okay for the time being. So we've got a nice army coming together there. This army is moving south. Any other armies that I've got should have an army up here, yep. What I'll do, I'll build a little watchtower there. And I'll build another watchtower there. And again, these guys will keep on heading south. Sending all of these guys down to the Egyptians. Really want to try and mess with the Egyptians as much as we can. Right, this army here. Uh, what should we do? Let's get these guys out. It's a nice pike unit, I think. Um, do, 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 these guys. Yeah, send them out. Let's try and recruit some more units like so. Because we've got loads and loads of money. We'll retrain them, leave that the way that is, and we'll build a little watchtower so we can see what's going on around here. We'll move these diplomats south so we can actually have a little gander on what's going on with these Egyptian settlements. Any other armies? I think there's an army in here, I think. Yeah, we'll get rid of that, disband that. 
just leave that the way that is. Those guys are good enough there, I think. Probably sent that cab unit in there. Got a bunch of peasants being produced. So that is looking all good. Any other armies around here? I think that's pretty much all of my armies being moved around. See you up. We'll get some more peasants in here. And there's a little temple which we'll destroy. And we'll build our own temple. Get rid of the sewers. And let's go and check out Sidon. Because I think Sidon needs repairing. So what we'll do, we'll repair all of these. Actually, we'll destroy that and build our own temple. Retrain those. And what else can we build here? Let's just get a bunch more infantry units. And in here we'll get... What should we get? Let's get a bunch more Javcav. And leave that settlement the way it is. There's no point getting more troops in there, I don't think. Just use Damascus to really pump out troops. So we'll go for Javcav there. And we'll go for infantry in Sidon. Like so. And then these settlements just have peasants in them. Probably build a few peasants in here. Try and get that settlement a bit happier. That's looking fine. Right, let's go and have a glance over here now. So we've got an army in here and we've got an army in here. So what we're going to do, we're going to leave a few units in here. Let's merge these together. Um, we'll leave, what should we leave in here? Let's leave those skirmishes. Skirmishes won't really do much. We'll get this cab out like so. We'll go and attack them. And we should be able to automatically resolve that. Clear victory. That's a nice one there. Send those guys into that little fort. And we'll merge them up together. What have we got left in here? We'll just get a bunch of peasants being produced. Disband that unit. Now this army, again we're going to send these south, I think. Any other armies, any other units in here. We'll produce a couple of peasants. Get rid of some of these boats. And we'll get rid of one of those guys. That's looking okay. We've got, again, more units here. Right, let's chuck some of these guys into this army here. Produce a really nice little build. There we go. And then that peasant unit can slowly go in there. And these Javcav units can go in there. There we go, that's one full stack. Uh, all we're doing at the moment, we're going to make a little barrier here to stop these... Stop all the, uh, the Spanish coming to attack. Any other units that I've got here? No, I think that's pretty much all of my armies around here. I think there's some army around here. We'll send these guys over here. Anything else going on around here? I think that's pretty much it. Right, let's go over to Diva now. Right, Diva. Let's go and knock down some of these buildings if we can. Because we've got a bit of a culture penalty going on at the moment. So we'll get rid of that. Any other units or buildings that we can destroy. I think that's pretty much everything that we can do. Then we'll rebuild these. We'll chuck everybody into the settlement. And we'll just merge them together. Chuck these guys in there if we can. There we go. And this little boat here, we're going to send back over here to go and support these guys. Try and keep them away from those rebels which are around there. Um, right, I think that's pretty much everything I can do at the moment. What I'm going to do now, I'm going to pause this for two moments just while I go for all of my settlements. Now I've got a load of money that I can spend. And I'm going to use this money to actually build some more um, you know, temples and bits and pieces like that. Now it's going to be pretty boring me just going around all of the settlements quickly building stuff so I'm going to pause it for two moments just while I do that so bear me two seconds guys 
There we go, and we're back. So we've gone through every single one of my settlements. I've built lots and lots of things. So there's at least two or three, two or three things in each of the pipelines, and that's going to keep me going. So I can just focus on the battles and trying to take out them nasty Egyptians. That's what the plan is going to be. Let's see what the Egyptians can do. Hopefully not much, because I'm going to absolutely try and slaughter them in this episode. That is the plan anyway. Right, pull back from that one. All I'm doing over there, I'm just kind of messing about, just trying to cause these guys just to chase my units around here. Whilst that buys me time to go down towards Nepti. And these guys, and just keep on sending them north. Oh, can't build any watchtowers there. So two more turns before I get to that settlement. And these guys are just slowly homing in there. Right, in the meantime, I've got these units up here. I'm going to send these south here. Um, let's get this army all out. Let's put those guys there. Put those guys together. I uh, should have some more armies up here somewhere. There we go. And then these guys can keep on coming down here. So we've got loads of little stacks around here for Legend of Total War to sort out. I'm sure he can uh, put together some nice armies. There we go. So we've got one stack here, a couple of little stacks around here, and those stacks coming together. Let's go and have a look at Diva. See what's going on there. Right, they're still not happy there, but that's not too bad. I put my ships in here. Let's try and retrain these ships here. And we'll get another ship there. Perfect, and that's going to have a nice little army, a nice little navy up there. In the meantime, let's go and take these Egyptians out. Let's see what damage we can do. Right, let's go for this. Let's try and take out this settlement. We've got plenty of rams. Let's go and assault it. They've only got, what, next to nothing there. So we're going to fight this on the map. We don't want to mess it up. We want to go for this and slaughter this settlement. And then you never know, within the same turn, we might actually be able to go north to take about a second settlement that the Egyptians have got. It's all about timing. Hopefully we can try and take out as many of these Egyptian settlements as possible within this episode. Maybe even take out the faction if we're particularly lucky. Just try and make it as easy as possible for Legend of Total War so we can just really focus on trying to take out the, uh, the Spanish. So where's my archer? Right. We don't want my archer pushing the, the ram. Send those guys there. Let's put this archer unit like so. Get these guys together like that. Let's put triple speed on. Get my guys nice and close. Right, those pikes are just run away. Absolute bellends. Come on. Why have they done that? I wanted to shoot them. Right, they've got a chariot unit there. What else have they got? And they've got a unit in the centre. Right, just knock down those walls. What else have we got? Let's get some more infantry. Put those guys together. Lift up those pikes. Put those guys together. And what else have we got? Uh, Let's get my cab together like so. What I'm going to do is going to get these guys into a nice little deep formation. Here we go, like so. Just don't want these guys to route, so I'll put them in a nice, really, really tight formation like so. Come on, we can do a lot of damage here. Let's get our jab cab nice and close now. Just chuck all your javelins into that spear unit. Come on, those guys should be, what, down to 44? Not quite dead yet. Right, all of those pikes. Let's group them all together. Get them a bit closer. Come on, these guys should be petrified. I know I would be. Right, 
Right, just send them forward. Come on. Down you come. Just munch into these guys. Come on, we should be able to beat them. There we go, sweet. Now that we've captured the wall, what we need to do, we need to get our pikes all the way over here now. We need to get our archers behind them, I think. Slingers behind them. And we're going to get our cav, if we can, like so. Triple speed should be on. Let's run our infantry, in fact. Run the archers. Run these guys. And we'll run these guys as well. And then what should we do with our cab? Yeah, just run them as well. Just run everybody across. Go, 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 go. Let's take out these Egyptians. All of our guys are now come through, it looks like. Apart from one unit that's pushing around, there's no point. Common infantry. Ooh, they're now tired. That's not great. Put our pikes down. Come on, get a bit closer. Right, slingers, you go for them. Archers, you go for them. Infantry, just push forward like so. Oh shit, look at all that damage those uh, chariot archers doing. I hate chariot archers. Hate them with passion. Right, come on, they should. Let's keep them pushing forward. Up of all of these pikes, with our spears down, let's just crush these chariots now. Right, that's it. Keep on going, keep on pushing. Archers, you keep on shooting at them. Slingers, there we go. General's dead. These guys should just route. Well, they won't be able to route now because they're tr fighting in their town square. There we go. Let's just now push forward with our pikes. There we go. Those guys, all finished, all done. Clearly won that. They killed 87 of my men, but we should be able to... I reckon we can just get this army now and just go straight for Memphis. I don't think we need to worry about... I don't think we need to worry about... Um, retraining the units in here. Let's just destroy them. And let's drop the tax level down to next to nothing, onto low tax. Now the army that I've got in here, uh, these guys are in the way. Have I got anything that can, what have they got? Just one unit. What unit is this? Oh, it's a spear unit. Um, I reckon two of these units should be able to take out this Axeman. Let's fight it on the map. The reason why I'm doing this, I want to try and get the units which are in that settlement in Thebes, I believe it is, to try and get into Memphis straight away because I've got a spy in there. I'm just kind of gambling and hoping. Right, where's the, the... There they are. Let's put triple speed on. What I want to try and do is go on either side of this unit and just throw lots of javelins at them. So I'll put one unit up here. And we'll put one unit like so. There we go. Are they out of javelins yet? Nope. Right. These guys just charge straight in. These guys are on skirmish. Oh, come on. There we go. We've got them. That was a bit sloppy on my half there. But heroic victory, apparently. 
I wonder if we've actually got another general. That'd be really handy to get a general because we've only got just the one down there. Come on, let's see what we can do. Fingers crossed. Is that going to be enough to get a general? Oh, yeah, it is. Sweet. All right, so we've got a general. Now, question is, can we get to Memphis? We can get to Memphis, but unfortunately the spy hasn't really done anything to help. But what have they got? They've got some walls. Who actually, what have they got in there? Axemen, Onager. Right, let's chuck everybody in there now. Let's get these infantry units. There we go. Uh, Thebes still fairly happy. I'll tell you what, let's get some more units. Thebes is still happy there, which is good. Uh, maybe another pike unit would be handy. And maybe a, another general. Oh, now that settlement's not happy, so let's build a bunch of peasants. Leave it like that. And we'll build some sewers. And hopefully that's going to be enough just to maintain them. Because once we've taken this settlement, if we can take this settlement next turn, it will mean that that settlement will actually give us a bit of a, a boost. Uh, what should we get? Let's get some rams and some ladders, I think. And let's get some mercenaries, just because we can. Okay, so at least that's one settlement down. How's things looking over here? These guys are still making their way over to Tingi. Right, let's try and put together a nice army here. So we'll put those units in there. Uh, what else have we got which we could add in there? Some more infantry units here. Let's go and attack this settlement here now. And we'll send the rest of these guys to go and support. Build some more rams. Now we've got space for one more. Tell you what, let's send that guy down there. Now these guys are attacking this settlement. I'm kind of banking and gambling that they're going to lift that siege and come and support this army here. Now in the meantime I've got some other stacks around here which I'm going to get and I'm going to send these guys so they're getting a bit closer towards Petra I believe and Bostra. There, there's Petra and there's Bostra. These guys are getting a bit closer now. And these guys are heading down here. Any other units I've got? There should be some more builds. I think. Here we go. There's that army up there, which we're going to send down here. And these guys. So let's just push back those rebels. Automatically resolve that. And those guys are going down south, so that's nice. Anything else that's going on? I think that's pretty much it. Got some pike units in there, which can be really handy. Um, what's going on here? Those guys are fine. Probably just leave that the way that is. I might just merge some of these units together. See what these Spanish are up to. Um, 80,000 denarii left. Ooh, I think that's fine. So what I'll do now, just end this turn. Okay, big battle here it looks like. So where is this going on? This is the battle for Jerusalem. So what have they got? Some infantry there, some cav units. Not so hot there and not so hot there. So let's find this on the map. If we can win this, we can take Jerusalem. And then that's going to be a big blow to the Egyptians. 
hopefully we can try and take as many of these settlements before that army to the north attacks my settlement, which is Sidon. So let's start this. We've got loads of pikes. Now these pikes aren't the best. Let's group them together, like so. Really nice tight box. Archers, we're going to stick behind. We're going to turn off skirmish mode, put guard mode on. And then my cav, which consists of pretty much generals, will hold at the back. Right, where are all of these reinforcements coming from? Where's the majority of their army? There it is, right. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to charge my cav units all the way down here. And then we're going to get these guys over there. It's going to charge them all the way down this hill. Let's put triple speed on. Come on, we can do this. Right, come on, Cav. Finish them all off. Right, where are we going to send our guys? I don't know. We shall send them up here, I think. Let's get those archers, shove them there, and my general, where should we send them? Send these guys just behind, like so, and let's just wait for these Egyptians to come towards us. All of my units are tired, so what have they got? Chariot archer, it's going to be a bit of a pain. Those guys, standard archers, some peasants, some uh, pikemen, more pikemen, and onager. What have they got over here? Oh, uh, yeah, nothing much to shout about. Come on, guys, get into range. All of my units are shattered now. Right, drop your pikes. Come on, we can kill these chariot archers. We can kill at least one of them, at least. Come on. Why aren't these chariot archers dying? Have I killed one? Yeah, I've killed, managed to kill one. And they've killed like a shitload of my guys. Oh man, and the onagers in range. Bloody hell. Right, that's not good. Right, enemy general is dead. That's good. Come on, archers, just fire as much as you can. All of these guys should be winded, tired. In they come. Right. Peasants, you take them out. Pull back. Pull back, pull back, pull back. Right, uh, who should we go for? Let's go for them, go for them. There we go, got a mass route going on now. Right, you chase them down, you chase them down. Come on, we can do this. We can kill all of these units here. Have they got anything left? Right. You units, you shoot them. Is there anything left? What are these guys up to? Come on. Have they caught them? Nope, sadly not. What have they got? Skirmishers? Come on. You guys should be able to chase in there and just take them out. There we go. Nice. Let's continue this battle. 
Let's try and kill all of these units. All of these generals. Right. You now go for them. Your units go for them. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. We can kill these chariots at least. Maybe not. Kill those units there. Any other Egyptians left? That's got to be it now. I wonder if this is enough now to take Jerusalem. We have killed all of their generals. Kill that last unit. We've got that now. Come on. There we go. Clearly won that. Now, a few of their men did survive. 26. No, 46 even. Is that going to be enough to take Jerusalem? We should be able to automatically resolve it anyway if they have taken, if they have maintained that settlement. Unless they're going to pull back the army that was besieging the settlement to the north and come and attack me. Let's see what the Egyptians will do. Um, sweet. So we've taken that settlement. Um, automatically resolve that. Uh, I'll pull back from that one. Not really asked about fighting Spain at the moment. I just really want to focus my efforts at trying to take out the Egyptians. So we've taken out Jerusalem. What's next on the agenda? Well, I'll tell you what's next on the agenda. We want to try and smash Memphis. Uh, the gates are open, which is even better. Let's go and assault this. Now they've got general which is going to be pretty hard to kill and they've got an onager onager is going to be a bit of a bitch to attack but the axemen should be okay so let's fight this on the map and let's see what kind of damage we can do and then you never know i might be able to get my spy out open up the gates in um, alexandria and go for that one as well if i can take that settlement that's going to be only two settlements left that the Egyptians hold. Again, we're trying to do this as quickly as we can. I want to try and make this really simple for Legend of Total War to pick up the pieces once I've finished. Oh, sweet. Even better, right. These guys are up here. What I'm going to do is charge in all of my guys. Let's try and take this settlement. Drop that. Come on, run everybody in. Let's triple speed this in. Right, how are we going to get... Let's send everybody here. I know my guy's going to get pretty exhausted by the time we get here. There we go, sweet. Everybody just run, 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 run. If we get here, I'll probably rest my guys for a few moments. Actually, no, I'll rest them here for a few moments. Turn off triple speed for a few moments. What are these guys doing? These guys, let's go for that energy unit there. On. We can kill that onager unit. Make short work of them. In the meantime, these guys, I don't know what they're doing. They're trying to shoot me. Come on. Come on. We can. I have to snipe this town off them. These damn onager units. Look how freaking OP these guys are. Absolutely wrecking my general. Come on, we can kill these guys. Right, all of these guys. Come on, kill this general. This general surely can't be all of my guys. There we go, that's it. Sweet, they're all dealt with. What have the Egyptians got left? Where are the rest of the Egyptians? They're stuck up here. Right, let's put triple speed on. Let's get 
those units and where are the Egyptians coming from? Oh, they're coming from over here, I think. Let's get all of these units to attack that one unit there. Drop your pikes down. There we go, they're finished, they're done. That should be it now, just need to wait a few moments. And then we've got this settlement, which is absolutely great. We destroy the settlement and then we send our guys north to Alexandria. So let's end that. Clear victory. Bit of a Pyrrhic victory. They killed just as many men as I killed theirs. But we have taken the settlement. So, so far this is going to be our third Egyptian settlement taken out. And I'm going to have three more left after this. And we're still doing pretty well for time. Come on. Destroy that settlement. Very, very nice. Let's put the tax level onto low. And let's get that agent out. Let's send this guy into Alexandria. So they've got three units in there. Question is... Ooh, they've got a decent army there. I'll tell you what, let's see what we can do. Let's see if we can get this guy. Ooh. We could actually try and rush this settlement. Now, what I'm going to do... I'm going to send these pikemen onto uh, that bridge. Like so. I'm going to send the archer unit. Like so. And... Can I send these guys any peasants or anything up here? Yeah, I can. So you can merge some of these units together. Yeah, let's get these units all together. Get them in there. They're just about happy. Right. All of this cav, we should be able to take out these archers. Take out these spearmen, I reckon. Could maybe do an infantry unit to support. Yeah, let's see what we can do. So, go and attack. Let's go and assault this. Good old peasant, as old, good old um, spies open up the gates. So, we're going to fight this on the map. Don't want to risk it. But this would be awesome if you take this because that's going to be three, no, four settlements of the Egyptians taken out pretty much less the space of about 30 minutes. So we're doing really, really well here. Let's keep on going. Keep on going. Show Legend of Total War how to do this. Right. Get our cab together. take these guys out of phalanx mode God be praised the reinforcements are here send them to fight this heart in the enemy right reinforcements are coming where are my reinforcements coming from ah shit they're attacking us let's pull back a bit Probably going to need these pikes to try and get through these walls here. Come on. Everybody run. If you can. There we go. Is triple speed on? It is now. Right. So they have got one infantry unit. And where is the other archer unit? There it is. So, one archer unit and a second one in the centre. Once my guys have got into range. Actually, let's get our jav cav. Send them over here. They should be able to throw their javelins into those units. Somewhat deplete them. down to 49 
So we're out of javelins now. Ooh, got some more jav cav which are sent forward. Get those guys to uh, shoot them. And then my infantry. There we go. Put these guys into flame attack. Infantry put in a really tight bunch like so. And we'll put the, the phallix down. These guys should be pretty tired. They should be pretty scared of all the flame attack. I'm hoping anyway. Panicked by fire. Right, sweet. I'm going to take my guys out of guard mode. I'm going to push them forwards. Come on. There we go. Sweet. Next thing I'm going to do. Send these guys in here. Lift up the, the pikes. Let's get our cav. Charge our cav in like so. And finish them all off. Infantry units. Send them all here. Is that cav now sorted them out? I think so. Just send our guys right into the centre now. Uh, where should we put these guys? Let's put my pikes like so. Let's get my cav and we'll chuck him in there. Or we'll chuck that unit there. That unit there. That unit there. Let's wait for all of these units now to come. Probably put them on to triple speed. I know they're going to be pretty tired by the time they get there. But I'm happy with that. Come on, go, 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 go. What have they got? Have these guys still got arrows left? Yeah, they have. Come on, archers, where are you? Come on, really deep formation now. And let's put the spears down. And we'll send them forward. Should be able to, to punch our way through these guys here. There we go. These guys shot can't beat us in hand to hand combat. Surely not, anyway. Come on. Let's get our cav come and support. There we go. So, rest of our cav. Everyone in now. No. Why are my guys starting to rout? That's not good enough. Come on. That's it now. We've finished them off. Sweet. Clear victory. We've taken Alexandria. Now we haven't got many pike units left, which is going to be pretty tricky. But I have got a plan. That's if I've got any more movement space with my general. Come on, there we go. So destroyed that. We're taking their big three settlements that the Egyptians hold. What I'm going to do... I'm going to send that general forward. So I'm going to build a little fort... These guys are just going to hold the ground. Um, right. What we need to do... Oh, we've got a bit of lag going on at the moment. I think the lag's... Is it disappearing? Yeah. It should disappear in a second. Actually, no. The lag isn't disappearing. I'm just going to pause this for two moments just while I sort this lag out. There we go. It looks like the lag's okay. Sometimes Fraps does this every so often when I'm recording. Oh, it's doing it again, which is freaking bloody annoying. Right, what can we do? Send these Bedouin guys there just to hold this bridge. We just merge these guys together. Got one decent infantry unit. We do need some more infantry units. Oh, 
bloody I'll turn off fraps again here we go I think that's a bit better now sorry about that all I've done there just for two seconds I got rid of these peasants and built a bunch of pikemen I'm gonna use these guys to try and stall back these armies here right in the meantime let's go and have a little glance up here so we've taken Jerusalem what we need to do is put together a nice little invasion force to try and take out uh, Bostra so I put these guys here build another little watchtower because we can and there's another army that's up here again these guys slowly sending their way making their way down here destroy those automatically resolve that I'll probably build a little watchtower here I think let's get some infantry units which I don't really need so again these guys are making their way down here these guys down here and we're holding our ground against all of these units so we're going to retrain as many of these pikes as possible there we go put the tax level down low Sidon is looking okay we'll retrain as many of these units as we can so we'll go for the pikes first of all there we go and then we're that's great probably disband one of those units disbands that unit there so everyone's been retrained Damascus what's going on in Damascus again we've got another nice little army here loads and loads of Jav Cav which I'll just disband some of these smaller units that we don't need and we're sent I don't know these guys over here the support and the head send those down to Bostra so we've got two settlements left that the Egyptians hold let's have a look to see what's going on over here gonna build a little watchtower nope getting closer now these guys go here can they get to that settlement in one turn not quite I don't think what have they got a general there mm. so next turn we'll get there we'll take that settlement right these guys will come down here so in another turn or so we should be able to take Nepti got this big stack of units up there and again we're just gonna pull my guys back so we're just on the bridges with our pikes and whatnot holding back all of these units let's just merge some of these units up together if we can if there's any space yeah we've got space for some of the jav cav to go and enter that army space for one more can we try and merge some of these units together probably send I don't know another general there I'll stick another general in there get any more mercenaries just some infantry and what about this army here right these guys can be a bit of a backup put those guys in with them again we'll merge as much of these guys as possible so chuck them in there now this is just kind of like a higgledy piggledy mess of units which I'll put there don't think we really need these guys here so I'm just going to disband those probably get a couple of peasants in there or one peasant in there disband those guys just tidy up some of our settlements here get rid of units that we don't need like so and like so now we've got a nice little navy here so we're going to use this navy to go and sink these rebels sink those rebels as well clear victory and then we're going to get these guys send them towards them 
Looks like Diva is now getting a bit happier, which is good. Going to try and merge these units all together and create a little army. There we go. So we'll get those guys, shove them there, build a little watchtower so we can see what's going over there. And we'll chuck those guys into Diva. So these guys are going to cross the narrows over to uh, Diva, over to Dublin. These guys have been retrained, sit on, producing more units there. Any agents? I've got a diplomat. Now, I wish I could bribe. I wonder if I could bribe this. This is faction air. Nah, he's not going to be bribed. I wonder if I could bribe Bostria. Nope, can't bribe them. Can I bribe Petra? Might be able to bribe Petra, but I need some infantry units to get in there. Uh, okay, so what else can we do? I think that's pretty much it. It's so making sure all of my armies are going down south and we'll end this turn. Ooh, the Egyptians are attacking us somewhere. Ooh, it's a huge army there. Where are they attacking me? Hmm, tricky one. I wonder if we can do this. Let's fight this on the map. I think this is probably one of the last big stacks the Egyptians have got left. But we have got the bridge. And we might be able to choke the bridge with our units. So let's start this. Right, here we go. And we've got our units. Let's see what we can do. So we're going to try and choke this. What we'll do, we'll put these guys like so. Put those guys behind. Put those archers behind. Let's charge everybody. Ten. Come on. Everybody run. Right. Turn off skirmish mode. Put flame attack. Put guard mode on. All my cab. I want to send them all down here. As quick as we can. You guys lift up your pikes and you run down here as quick as you can as well. Come on. Why did it take so slow? Go, go, go. Right, cav units down here as well. Come on, down you come. Right, let's keep them backspacing. Come on, kill all of these chariots. Just munch this entire Egyptian army down as quick as we can. To lift up your pikes. Come on, come down here. Lift up your pikes. Alright, sweet. They're now here now. Run them down as quickly as, as we possibly can. And let's just hold this ground. few of my uh, problem about these phallic pipe they've got dead small shields and they are vulnerable against archer fire as you can see their units are getting whistled down pretty quickly the only thing I can hope is that they try and charge everybody in let's move our cab in there turn off skirmish mode Where's my pikes? They're coming down. They're on their way. They're on their way. Come on, Phalanx pikemen. Hold the ground. You can do this. Let these guys just try and charge right across here. And as they come across, I'll smash them. What have they got? Is the general coming in now? Sweet. 
He's coming in now. Kill more and more of these chariots. It's going to drop them around. Enemy general's dead. That is perfect. Now they're starting to rout. Here we go. Now we've got a bit of a mass rout going on in this nice little clump here. And as they rout, they're going to try and charge across this bridge right into my pikes. Reinforcements are on their way. Archers, let's just sh shoot the other archers. Come on. Right, let's put triple speed on now. These guys are now, let's drop down the pikes. Infantry, back space, back space. Come on, hold the ground. Doing really, really well here. Just finishing off all of these Egyptians. Right, what can we do against these guys? Oh, Cav, I think we need to do something. Maybe pull these guys back. Come on, these guys must be out of their ammo shortly now. Come on, finish off these units. They're now into loose formation. These guys got a 60. Right, let's lift our pikes up and let's charge them back. Right, come on, in we go with a charge. Oh, no, 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 no. Ah, uh, don't tell me they've taken Jerusalem. I mean, don't tell me they've taken Alexandria because of that. We destroyed loads of their men. Ooh, just... Right, I'm going to pull back from that. There's no point trying to fight that one. Uh, where's this? Um, yeah. What are we fighting? Yeah, I'm going to pull back from that one. Carthaginians, no way am I going to give them that amount of money. Hmm, okay. Uh, right. I wonder if we can do this. Can we fight this on the map? Yeah, let's see what we can do. Let's fight this on the map and try and take out that Numidian army. Really want to try and finish off the Numidians in this episode. And we're so close to doing that. We're so, so, so close. Right, lift up our pikes. Let's put our pikes like so. Put our archers behind. Like so. Turn off skirmish mode, put on guard mode. Make sure these guys on guard mode. Drop the phallix, I'm going to put triple speed and we'll see what they do. They should just try and get to given a nice column and just charge straight into me. If they do that, I'll put a flame attack on, I think. There we go, come on, kill all of these guys. Enemy king's dead. It's even better. Right, those guys are dead, come on, finish. I'm frantically pressing backspace every time they come and attack my pikes. My pikes drop their units down. Let's turn off flame mode now. There we go. Come on, just shoot these guys now. Come on. There we go. Sweet. They're all finished. Continue the battle, and we're done. Heroic victory. I might even get a general because of that. I should get a general because that's pretty imp impressive. Now that's done. So the other army that I've got near Tingi should be able to go straight towards that settlement now. 
and it's going to withdraw that. Automatically resolve that. Clear victory. There we go. Man of the hour. Right, so they have got a few armies attacking me. Now, I wonder, I should have a diplomat somewhere. Do I have a diplomat anywhere around here? Right, uh, retrain these units like so. And we'll probably get some folksmen. Don't know what's in there. But I reckon we're safe. We're safe again for another turn or so. Send these ships up here. In the meantime, what we're going to do here now. These guys are getting closer to this settlement here. Got a decent sized army here. And a decent sized army up here. And put these guys up here probably. We join these two armies together. Right, in the meantime with this army. What I'm going to do, I'm going to take out a bunch of these units here. And I think what I'm going to do. Yeah, I'm going to send these guys south. I want to go for Petra here. Can I bribe this settlement? Nope, I can't bribe it. But next settlement, we should be able to get to them. Then we should be able to merge those guys together and then go for Bostra. Now, these guys... Oh, these guys are just taking up my time. Come on, right. Now we're close. Now we're there. Let's go and attack Tingi. What should we build? Let's build some rams and some... There we go. That army's together. That army's together. That is sweet. So we're going to be able to take that settlement next turn, I reckon. And in the meantime, these guys are coming down here. Let's try and get rid of these rebels. Come on. Bribe them, just get rid of them. Yeah, I don't care how much money you want. Nope. Right, come on. That is so close now. And I'll send these guys just to harass that army up there. We are doing really, really nice now. So, actually, shit, we've got that settlement. Oh, I didn't realise that. I bribed the settlement, not the... Uh... Oh, I hope these rebels don't pop in there. Probably will, knowing my luck. Damn it, right. Uh, that's not too bad, I don't suppose, anyway. Meantime, these guys were just holding our ground against all of the Spanish that are kind of popping up there. Um, next turn, we should be able to go for them. Let's just end this turn and take it to the next one. Withdraw we'll from that. Automatically resolve that. Nepti is rioting, but that is okay, because we've now got our army in there. Let's repair that, drop the tax levels down, destroy that temple, build our own temple. And what have we got? That's looking okay, I reckon. Give it a couple of turns, and that should be fine. This army, what we're going to do, what have they got? Some chariot archers. What's in there? Nothing much, really. Come on, get these guys. Let's go and attack. 
There we go. All of these guys now besieging that settlement. Um, what should we do? Put those units together. Let's make a really nice army. Get rid of the camel units because they're next in shit, really. Get some more Jav Cav, more generals. There we go. So we've got one nice stack there. Send these guys in there, and these guys can come in as support. So close to finishing off the Egyptians and the Numidians. Chuck those guys in that boat. Come on, across we go over there. Come on, Diva. Cheer up. Why are they so annoyed? Again, holding our ground against all the, the Spanish around there. Let's go and build some do, 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 diplomats, I reckon. Diplomat there. And another diplomat somewhere else, I reckon. There we go. They're fine. So we've got some diplomats being built so we can try and bribe some of these armies around here. So, 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 so close. Could we actually attack this settlement? We can. I tell you what, we're coming up to an hour. Let's fight this one. Um, now, we could automatically resolve this, but I'm scared of automatically resolving it and messing it up. So I'm going to fight it on the map. I'm going to go for it. Take out the last Numidian settlement. Let's see what we can do. Come on. Right, start deployment. Let's see, what have they got? They've got some rubbish units on the walls. We'll get our pike units. We'll One of these units are going to be in range to try and shoot those guys up on that wall. Yeah, they're, all, they're in range now. But they're actually doing any damage. Doing any damage? No, not doing any damage. Just wasting their ammo. Okay, so we try that. That didn't work. Let's use our ram instead to try and make a hole through this gate. Actually, no, let's not do that. Let's get these guys on their ladders and try and take this wall here. If we can take the wall, then what we might be able to do is use these little uh, gateways to shoot these units here. So in they come, just making their way across, nice and chilled. Go on, up we go. Let's take the gateway. Ladders are on the wall. And what have they got? They've got some Jav Cav shooting their units. They're going to expend their ammunition. Got practically nothing, which is fine. And they've got some Bedouin units over there. Right, here they come. Come on, let's just get on here. Off the... Right. Come on, our guys should be able to beat these units. There we go. Bit of a glitch there, so press back space. Come on. Drop your pikes. Drop your pikes. Ah, oh, these guys are just chewing up my units. Why is that? Oh no! Holding the holding the line. Come on! Come on! Go! 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 Just keep on going. Keep on pushing. 
Right, that unit's now routing. Let's keep on going, we'll keep on going. Why are their spears so short? But they're short spears for some reason. Okay, so have we managed to kill one of those units? Not really. Okay, instead, what should we do now? Let's send these guys onto this wall here. And let's send that unit to go and deal with that. Come on, don't get the ram, don't burn, don't burn, don't burn, don't burn. There we go. We've made it. Sweet, so we're going to take and knock down this gate, hopefully. Come on, shoot these units up here. Let's backspace. Let's get all of our cab and let's just chase, charge all our cab in there. Come on. There we go. So we've taken that. Man, we're losing loads of guys. Let's try and take take this gateway. Come on, Cav. All right, great. So we're taking the walls. Let's just take our time now and shoot all of these units that we can. There we go. These guys are now dead. Hold our ground for a tiny bit. We've been shot by this dam. Right. Pikeman, take that gate. Come on. Finish all of these units off. There we go. So they're dealt with. They're finished. Let's now move them down here. So what have they got? They've got their general or the king, the camel unit, and some more units there. Right, so what I'll do, I'll probably push my cab up here. Get my pike unit, I don't know, like so. And my an archer unit at the back, even though I've got no ammunition. Come on, come on. Right, nice big bunch of units here. Let's put the pikes down. Push these guys forward like so. Come on, hopefully they're going to come towards me. Get my cav. Come on, hold the ground. The enemy general is slain. Enemy general's dead. Finish those off. That's it. We've taken it. Numidians are finished. Numidians are dead. Come on, finish them. Oh no 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 no! Oh, how did that even happen? Oh, what? They've got like two men left. Oh, no. Damn it. Damn, damn, damn. Oh, well. 
you can't win them all, unfortunately. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to end this replay at this stage. I'm going to send Legend of Total War a bit of a message. So all he needs to do is go for Tingi, um, go for Jerusalem, Petra. He's got two nice armies there, and he's also got an army ready to go and land in Dublin. And uh, what I will do though, before I actually physically finish it, I'm going to quickly go around all my settlements for two moments, and then I'll save the replay and then I'll send it to him. So I'll catch you guys soon for the next episode. And thanks so much for watching. Again, it's been an absolutely amazing episode. Managed to destroy loads and loads and loads of Egyptians, and the Egyptians are practically on their knees. At as are the Midians. So hopefully Legend of Total War can finish off the Egyptians, finish off the Midians, take uh, Dublin and maybe even start the war against Spain. So we'll see what happens and I'll catch you guys soon. Cheers and bye now.